Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, but before we get into the video, if you guys could do me a huge favor and hit that subscribe button and like the video, that will do a great deal of help to the channel. Also, tell me down below that you have subscribed, but without further ado, now that you've done that, let's get into the video. Hello everyone and welcome back to another video for Destiny 2 Season of the Hunt, aka Beyond Light. Today we'll be going over the Frenzied Quarry Triumph, which requires you to kill Hive or, you know, Fallen Bosses on Dreaming City or Tangled Shore. You also need to use a seasonal weapon, so as you can see I have the Friction Fire and the Deafening Whisper right here. First things first, you're going to go to the Tangled Shore and you're actually going to activate a Wrathborn Hunt. The one that we're going to activate is actually going to be Savix, so act activate that and then end up putting in whatever mods you really want. It doesn't really matter because we're actually not going to be completing this. Once you've done that, simply do the required steps to activate the Wrathborn Hunt. So, you know, go up to the Cryptoglyph uh, lure, activate it, and then start killing the boss. It, you know, you'll end up going to the Wrathborn Hunt, but we want to initiate the hunt first. This one is probably the easiest to get to and the easiest to kill because, you know, it's just a more convenient location. Once you've, you know, made it run away or made it retreat, you want to then follow the green path towards where you would normally go for the Savix Wrathborn hunt. In this area, you want to actually go up to the, you know, little tracker that says track the Wrathborn and continue it. This is actually a really bad spawn, but you want to remember the location that it spawns. Basically, a god roll spawn for this is you want it to spawn closer to the cave, but I digress. Anyways, so what you're going to do, as soon as the Wrathborn Hunt is loaded up, you're going to go play through it as you normally would, and go towards when you need to put down the Cryptoglyph, and then once you're about to kill the boss, and once you kill the boss with a seasonal weapon, I cannot stress this enough, you want to actually abandon the activity, and then go back into it. Doing this, you'll be able to farm the Servitor as many times as you want to get that Triumph done. If you're having trouble doing it, I recommend doing Crow Packages or at least getting up to five Wrathborn Hunts and then getting the Heavy Grenade Launcher from Crow. But that's been the video, guys. If you guys could do me a huge favor, hit that like button, subscribe if you are new, hit the notification box, I'm posting daily Destiny content like this and other content on my channel. And of course, guys, have a great day and peace out.